Right, it's a reading for Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, or Rising. It's going to be um, all about you reading Sag. So um, I'll go through the cards as we put them down so you know what they are about. Just shuffle a few times. If you could like, share, and subscribe, that'd be great. Uh, and thank you if you already have, much appreciated. Right, we'll begin. Sagittarius Sun, Moon Rising. So first card is um, what's going on inside you at the moment, what's going on with you. Second card is how have you been seeing me by this time. Third card is, um, yeah, brain's gone dead. What's your secret? Why it's your secret? What's in your conscious mind? What's in your heart? What's in your soul? And the outcome of this situation. Right, we'll read a bit of energy from the bottom. Right, so we've got the Wheel of Fortune. It's all about destiny. It's all about um, karma, all those things. Um, Scorpio, Taurus, Leo and Aquarius energy. But it's about your destiny, it's about <clears throat> how, whatever all this is about, how it's going to turn out. It's to do with karma, basically, yeah. It's something you've been taking a lot of preparation in, something you've been finding very burdensome. And it could involve a cancer Pisces or Scorpio, it could involve a commitment, it could involve love with that big cup of love. But somebody's controlled their emotions right now. Somebody was being very generous, but in a situation with the Six of Pentacles there. Someone had a prophecy about that there. There could be a, even a pregnancy around the situation. Somebody's trying to gain hope in the situation as well. Like somebody was pouring water into two different ponds. They were pouring some water in front of them, but they were also pouring some water behind their back. Yeah, and it could involve the father of your children or Virgo towards the Capricorn. Someone was being very generous. Someone was also looking at the money. <clears throat> could have been very spiritual as well, but there's going to be judgment on the situation. Two children could have been involved. It could be something from the past. Yeah, something you want to have recognition reward in. Could even be like a soulmate relationship as well, with the King and Queen of Cups coming out pretty close to each other. Yeah. Someone's someone's like both those are in there got out of their emotions, like controlling their emotions at this time. There will be a resolution or someone's working on a resolution in something that you were very uncertain about, something you tried to take action in and it could involve a Leo. But you may have made a decision. You may listen to your intuition about that, about breaking free from a family situation. Yeah, making a departure. Something you were quite dedicated in doing. It could have involved money. You needed to trust in the situation. There was an indifference in love. Yeah, and you had an inspiration about it. Maybe even about someone doing some magic. On your luck. And your abundance. And your money. You need to heal from that situation. Yeah, it could even have been involved in your commitment as well. Yeah, you need to make progress forward and, and speak your truth. You get victory that way. Yeah, it could even be someone you're married to, someone you have children with. Or they could have been trying to affect all of those things. There's a lot of gossips around the situation. You had a vision of it as well and you gained some wisdom. You may have even had a dream about the situation, about Ten of Pentacles, a lot of money. And a lot of restrictions that were put up against you on a blessing. Yeah, and it could have involved a Leo. You need to break free from the situation. Someone was mad jealous about somebody getting crowned, basically. And really mad jealous. Like, if you look, you, that, I can't get it right. That one's getting crowned, but the one in the background is really, really jealous. And someone was very determined and had ideas, even an enlightenment on the situation, even on a tower moment, somebody had ideas on bringing down a tower on somebody, and somebody had an enlightenment to it, so somebody knew what was going on. It was on someone's comfort and causing someone a lot of stress and juggling some money and choices that they made, and it caused a lot of drama, and it was on your support. Yeah, you need to end these cycles to get success. Maybe a, a, somebody to, had a reflection someone could have even been doing some something with a mirror i see that with i don't normally see it but i see it today for some reason <laughs> somebody shone a light on that situation there and there was a big snake on someone's stick virgo energy someone was being a player but that's your energy sad yeah someone was a cheater as well yeah somebody went on a journey and it could have involved a leo it took a lot of courage though whatever it was somebody wanted to have a new beginning with innocence and it was a test 
it was all a test and it was all challenges. So whatever you did, good, bad, or indifferent, it, you were being tested, you were being challenged in this situation. You were being guided as well, so hopefully you listened. You needed to take back your power and isolate yourself and take independence. And it could have involved your love, a partnership, something that could have caused you heartache, something that even could have had a complete ending of. Yeah, somebody needs to gain integrity after a loss in a situation, and it could have involved an Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius, and it definitely involved a theft. Right, we'll begin. So, what's going on inside you at this time is you're thinking about friendships, or friendships are on your mind or going on inside of you at this time. What's that about? Something you were trying to blindfold yourself to a truth about. Yeah, and it's something that's also caused you heartache, a lot of air energy, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, and it also is a communication. Communication, yeah. On a situation that was keeping you up over night time, but you were being spoken to, you got a lot of air energy here, something you were uncertain about, and it was keeping somebody's in their wheel of fortune, like locked in their wheel of fortune. Oh, we see that in that one, because someone's locked in that wheel of fortune. And it could have involved a uh, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn, or the mother of your children, but a Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn, and a Gemini, Libra, or Aquarius, somebody who wanted to have a new beginning. Yeah, and it was a new beginning with abundance, but there's a truth being spoken on it, and somebody needs to drop some burdens now, or burn some burdens. Mm. I won't take those, let's keep going. So what are the burdens about? Yeah, somebody, you could be getting a message from a soulmate as well. Could be a message and an emotion message message with emotions and it could be about even a cancer energy somebody getting their chariot and moving away they haven't moved away yet but they want to send a message of truth maybe before they do and this is all going on inside you at the moment right well how are people are seeing you they're seeing you trying to make peace trying to balance the situation out Sarge. and that's your card temperance card <clears throat> Like she's pouring cup from water from one cup to another. Oh. Yeah, and it's got to do with somebody being very generous. <clears throat> on a blessing, on somebody's blessing. And somebody's trying to balance that situation out now. Maybe somebody was very generous with somebody's blessing. I don't know how you get blessed. <laughs> how that works, but that does. Yeah, and it could involve a Leo. Somebody working on a lot of money, someone could be, could have been to do with music or could have been to do with somebody um, working on some artistic, put it that way. It's definitely somebody working on something. It could involve an Aries with a big love heart. Or an Aries Leo or Sagittarius, yeah. Someone was doing something very dark there and it had to do with somebody having a lot of money and being very, very... Like that person's not happy, and I see it every time in that card. Yeah, somebody saw someone as a star, or somebody tried to keep doing something, maybe. Yeah. And now that's left somebody with somebody moving away, getting their ship, moving away, going to find something, something different, something new. Let's just change up my cards a minute. Yeah, I'll do a couple of these. <clears throat> so, what's this about? What's this? Balance needed in this situation, getting in the ship moving away. Yeah. Someone was trying to perfect something. Someone was trying really hard to make something, you know, maybe even work in their way. Somebody could need to speak because I see that in that car for some reason. Yeah, was, somebody was trying to make somebody insecure as well. And somebody had a lot in enlightenment to that situation. Maybe that was you, Sarge, or maybe you. Yeah. And it was all about vanity. But somebody, yeah, and... The situation ended up being bittersweet for some reason. What have we got that bittersweet? Mm. It didn't work out, yeah. Somebody needs to release these things now. Someone was doing a lot of magic and uh, yeah. And they were working really, 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 really hard on doing that situation. Like really hard, right? What your secret is is whatever all this is, is it actually making you sad? <clears throat> I'm gonna get this one as well because it always makes more sense to me. <coughs> 
Right, your secret is this is sadness and it's something that you celebrate over. Yeah, this sadness there is something you've been dissipating in. Maybe you've been trying to make something work in a long time and there's a lot of gossips and people talking now and it's on somebody's quest. <coughs> Maybe somebody didn't like somebody's quest, yeah. Somebody having a renewal and it has to do with a lot of abundance. It could have been like one main woman. A house could have even been sold in a situation, but somebody was trying to dig into some money literally and two men were like they don't look like they're too happy about it like they were a bit stressed about it yeah somebody of course somebody did a lot of grief as well i feel like in 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 these times there's a lot of people that have done some stuff and things are turning around so it depends which side you're on yeah somebody somebody's in grief over somebody's grief and somebody having prayer somebody like doing the right thing i suppose Right, what are these celebration? Why is this celebration something that somebody celebrated over? It's causing somebody a lot of grief now. Yeah, and it's over something somebody was waiting for somebody was waiting for something to come in. But they've ended up now crying over some spilt milk because they're looking at what's collapsed in a situation, what's fallen in a situation. And they were enlightened to that situation. Somebody just chose to hang upside down and they celebrated on it as well. But whatever it is now has caused them sadness, caused them grief. But they'd already celebrated on it, yeah. And somebody's going to come in with a very blunt truth about the situation, speak about the situation very bluntly on a family situation. And it's got something to do with somebody looking at what they'd harvested in the past somebody already harvested somebody already celebrated on it somebody already thought they got it in the bag yeah somebody was trying to ignore the situation there's people watching as well two people were always watching watching somebody sleep watching everything yeah could have involved a cancer Pisces or scorpio somebody who's probably going to send a lot of messages as well on the situation or there's a lot of messages coming in it could just be somebody got very emotional about the situation right on your conscious mind is this blessing and a virgo could shine a light on the situation or hermit kind of virgo energy yeah somebody made a choice and when they made a choice between two people it ended up causing them to be blindfolded to a truth and it's got something to do with blessing yeah it caused heartache and it's on your conscious mind somehow and it involves a cancer crisis or Scorpio, it's something where there was somebody left, jump ship basically, after the magician Gemini energy, but yeah, manifesting something, it caused an ending, it caused a death, it caused a, could have even caused a death, or maybe they wanted to, yeah, end of all cycles. A new beginning, that's the last card in tarot. What's in your heart is this home situation. So what's that about? And it involves a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, or somebody who is somebody from your past as well. Somebody could be quite cold from your past. And it caused you to be up of a night time. There's definitely a need to balance this situation out or a home situation, something to do with a home. It could even involve a Leo shining a light on a situation somehow. Yeah, and then my one night stand energy, or it could be that somebody had an inspiration or something from the past. Right, I'm going to change my cards up for you again. Use the millennials. Right, what's in your soul? Is you're trying to control this situation? You could even be trying to control the money situation. Yeah, something you had a wish on. Yeah, somebody could be looking out the window now. It could be somebody you're married to, or you could be looking out the window. Someone's looking out the window watching, and someone needs to cut something out. Like, you know, cut and clear something out of their life. It could even be a Leo. Or the sun card, somebody shone a light on the situation. About somebody else in the background, maybe, and some dodgy money, and somebody having the feeling like that was their, that was their purpose. That was their, um, I'm trying to think of the word. The star card, that's like your, um, yeah, someone's destiny, someone's purpose. Time's ticking on that situation as well. Somehow, 37, 29, 10 and 41 could be relevant. Yeah, a new beginning's going to happen there. Somebody's got two doors to go down. 
and there could, there could even be like another man and another woman in this situation involved in the background that aren't being seen maybe yeah somebody had somebody in a maze and it's caused a lot of burdens but yeah you're being guided though you're being guided this is all going to come out in public as well about this isolation about this anxiety and about this bridge that should be could be crossed but it's all on fire it's like you know not really happening anymore right this last one is, I'll change my cards quick for this. <clears throat> yeah, let's do some of these. <laughs> got it. Yeah, so we've got this transformation of a situation, death card, Scorpio energy. Someone has com is going to completely end in a situation, so there will be a transformation. It has something to do with somebody was making plans on someone's choices. I see that all the way through here. Somebody was watching something, planning something. They had somebody in the background helping them. There's a lot of, there could have even been magic and stuff going on. There's a lot of it. May, somebody may need to walk away, put their hands up from the situation and just walk away. Or somebody's about to, and it's got something to do with the choices they made, yeah. And it could be on a higher level of commitment or a marriage, yeah. Somebody spied, spied a lot, saw a lot of things, was watching maybe online. Or it could even be like, it could even be an investigator. Somebody even stomped on a child's head as well. Yeah, somebody tried to go off and have a new beginning after ending all these cycles and it could have even been a lot of pregnancies around the situation but anyway, there's judgment going to be called on the situation it could even be on a child where there could now be an indifference in love somebody who's only looking at what's fallen away and it could involve an Aries or an Aries Leo or Sagittarius with a few children around them something that caused you heartbreak and yeah, and this family situation where people were watching this show somebody trying to beat down the devil yeah, and that had to do with an Ace of Pentacles. There was a dragon guarding some money and an Empress in reverse. So that's somebody who's, you know, it could even be a mother figure, but it's somebody who's, uh, or a Libra, somebody who's basically will do anything to make something go their way. In a fair party, in a fish, in a cup. <laughs> that could be people who celebrate it. It could also be a fair party. It could be a black man a white man and a woman all involved in that situation and a younger earth sign Virgo Taurus or Capricorn something where there is no balance anymore no balance in the situation what's that 10 points for mm. I'll just do a couple of these why well, have we got the 10 points for the yeah, someone's just been really cunning, really clever, really sneaky, really underhand, doing a lot of things to be cunning. Could have been a nerve sign, doesn't have to be. That person's really anxious now, they're stressed out. Yeah, and they've got a big mountain in front of them to get around that. It's not even going to be an easy journey. Yeah, and it could even involve a child and a new relationship, someone new that was started. Somebody's going to send a letter and it could involve you, Sag. You could need to smudge at this moment around your home as well and cut things out as well, most definitely. Yeah, and it's definitely to do with your home and past life connections. Could even be involving family, children, and lilies, which is um, something just needs to end. There needs to be a death or something. Also, that's what somebody wanted to see lilies on the altar. Yeah, and somebody being strong and abundant, and there's a lot of people talking and gossiping about the situation right now, maybe on WhatsApp or on a phone. I say WhatsApp, I just because I use <laughs> WhatsApp. Yeah, there's a lot of people talking though in both ones. You've got an air sign and a fire sign in communication. There's a water sign being quite nosy as well. Someone's going to get the key to some information. Someone needs to use their intuition, and that could be you, Sash, because you're right there. Anyway, I'm going to leave it there with love and light. Take care, so bye bye.